What's up guys? Click the subscribe button and press the bell icon to stay updated with our videos. Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. So SBI PO 2018 notification is out. There are 2000 vacancies. So today I'm going to discuss this notification, who can apply, how to start your preparation, which books to follow, which study material to follow. And please watch this video until the end of the video because I'm going to share the free study material for SBAPO at the end of the video, right? So let's start. First of all, uh, what is the last date to apply for this exam? It is 13th of May 2018. The application process will start from 21st of April and will it will end on 13th of May. So 13th of May is the last date for the application and the date of pre-exam is 1st, 7th. Uh, and 8th of July 2018 and the date of mains exam is 4th of August 2018. So these are the main dates and then what is the eligibility criteria? The same age should be between 21 years to, to 30 years and the cutoff date to calculate the eligibility, to calculate the age eligibility is 1st of April 2018. So on uh, you should be eligible on 1st of April 2018 and the date uh, and the eligible age is 21 years to 30 years. Then what is the eligibility criteria for education, graduation from a recognized university and if you are appearing for your final year exams, if you are in your final year, right, even then you are eligible but the results should be declared before 31st of August 2018. And obviously the reserve category students, they are going to get, you know, uh, benefit in that uh, eligibility criteria. Obviously, there is an age relaxation of five years for SCST candidates and three years for OBC candidates and 15 years uh, for uh, PWD, PWD candidate of SCST. So uh, there are five categories for the age relaxation. Then uh, the important part the exam criteria i mean the exam pattern for the pre-exam there are three sections same as the last year english language quantitative aptitude and reasoning ability uh, 30 marks in english language 35 35 marks each in quantitative aptitude and reasoning ability there is a sectional timing of 20 minutes each in each of the section one hour the total duration of the exam 100 marks and the expected cutoff should be between 54 and 55, 54 to between 54, 55 to 60, depends upon the exam difficulty level. If there is an easy exam, it should go beyond 60. If, if it is a difficult exam, it can remain 48, 49 or even 50. So it is unpredictable based upon the difficulty level of the exam. So let's move forward to the mains exam. I'll tell you what to study for this exam uh, in this uh, video. What is the main the pattern of the mains exam? There is reasoning ability and computer aptitude, 45 marks. Data analysis and interpretation, 35 marks. General, uh, general awareness, economy and banking awareness, again 40 marks. English language, 35 marks. So there is sectional duration, 60, ma 60 minutes allotted to reasoning ability, 45 minutes allotted to data interpretation and data analysis. 35 minutes to general uh, general awareness and 40 minutes to English language. Total, its uh, duration of the whole exam is three hours and total 155 uh, questions are there with 200 marks, right? So, some of the question in this, uh, in this, in this, you know, sections will be of two markers and right. So, there will be a weighted average scores in this, uh, in these sections. Then there will be, after the objective test, there is a descriptive test of like 30 minutes students uh, with two questions for 50 marks each. And that will be a test of English language. There will be essay writing and the letter writing. In the descriptive paper, there will be only essay writing and only letter writing. Two questions, 50 marks each, right? Each of the question is not, uh, it is not clearly mentioned that how many question will be of two marker or one marker about what is the weightage of each of these, uh, you know, sections, but there will be 155 questions and the total marks and the maximum marks are 200, right? So it is not clear that how much marks are actually allotted to each of the, you know, question, 155 questions and 200 marks. So it is little bit unclear, obviously. So, which will be followed by group discussion and interview. So, there will be a descriptive paper with the mains exam, right? 
so what next so there are maximum number of chances for for general the if you have appeared for the pre level exams uh, for four times uh, the pre the attempts in the preliminary exams are not counted only the attempts in the mains level exams are actually counted so basically that's all that's all basic information about uh, this notification student what i have for you now so students i have started providing a complete sbi po study material bag and that bag is available for free yes for the first time i am providing all my content all my content for free that is available for free to all the subscribers of bank exams today so please subscribe this channel i'm going to provide a lot of good study material for sbi po level exam i'm going to provide the proper test i'll go going to provide the proper study material the link to the study material is available in the description please check the description first of all uh, i'll provide the proper you know uh, pdfs there is like 900 pages of content is already available for free again i'm going to update the team back exams today is going to update that study material every monday starting from now onwards we are going to update that study material so it is a please check the description for the study bag sbi po 2018 study bag is available the link is available in the description go to bankexamstoday.com and install bank exams today's mobile application very important further uh, we have started the sbi po 2018 premium course for our students so after enrolling for this course you are you are going to get all the video classes notes and the study material for the sbi po level exam so there will be a daily class which will be followed by proper quiz right proper test and there will be live doubt clearing sessions as well so the demo content is available on bankexamstoday.com and the demo classes are also available on bankexamstoday's mobile application so in case you have any doubt uh, with regard to this exam you can ask your doubt in the description i'll be answering all the doubts and further i am also providing my number 9067201000 that is also available in the description as well you can personally email me raman at the rate of bank exams today.com so what i can recommend you is please subscribe to this channel and install bank exams today's mobile application and the link to free sbi po study bag is available in the description i am providing it in the description please go there you will be uh, you will get all the pdfs for free last year we were selling that uh, those all the all notes for i think 300 rupees but this year we uh, we are giving it for free so please download the study bag and please update your study bag every week that is very important for you and in case you want to join uh, you need proper guidance in case you want to you know chat with your teachers if, if in case you have uh, some doubts regarding the exam i highly recommend you to join bank exams today's bank exam today's sbi po course till now a lot of students have we are, we are actually doing this course from 2013 until now a lot of thousands of students have cleared the sbi po and ibps po exams using bank exams today's content so that's all for today students please subscribe the channel and i'm providing my number i'm providing my email address everything in the description please check the description that's all for today students thank you and have a very nice day and best of luck bye